Yamaha XJ600S diversion for sale on eBay. In the paperwork it has its um, service and warranty book. It started to be filled in there and I think just had its first one done. Yeah, nobody bothered with any of the rest of them in there. There's its owner's manual. It's got its V5 registration document, one former keeper. It's got its data tag paperwork there. It's got some old MOT test certificates with the last MOT test certificate expiring September 2009. It's got its service history. That seems to be running up to about 2008 as far as I can make out on the paperwork there. It's also got some... Oh, it's also got the HPI check certificate, which I've just done. That shows the bike is all completely clear. Nothing else there in the bike's history to be concerned about. It's also got a bit of a relevant paperwork there. Um, and also I've done the direct.gov MOT history test printout there. Nothing showing up there of any interest. So just looking around the bike, a few little things to point out. This bike has been in storage for a couple of years. Um, the battery, strangely, does seem to be sort of working on it. Um, it was flat, I charged it up and it's been starting the bike ever since. So there's that. Um, there are stains on the exhaust system down there. I don't know what's been causing that stain, but these bikes usually do dribble a little bit of oil in there, here and there. Um, I, I think they come out the back of the engine there somewhere, on maybe the timing chain adjuster or something, which is a regular thing. It's not worth doing anything about it. nobody ever does. There's that. Um, the fuel in the bike is quite old. I've been for a ride on the bike and it doesn't perform as it should do. It feels like it's got a blocked pilot jet, at least one of them, maybe two of them. Um, with a bit of choke on the bike seems to perform relatively normally um, when you get underway a bit. But it certainly doesn't take over as smoothly as it should do. Um, so you're going to need to take the carburetors apart and clean those. I expect there's filth in the tank which has been sitting around a bit as well. But basically the bike seems like it's been a well maintained up together bike tyres seem to be sort of quite good, there's nothing kind of loose on the bike, it just feels um, like he just wants putting back into service really, so there we go, good luck with the bidding.